it's like it's like the wild wild west, bro. Like folks is really out here leaving people cars on bricks. Like they stealing people tires and rims and leaving the cars on bricks. They breaking people windows. Like folks is leaving their windows down because they rather people they rather them go through their car than break the window to get through their car. Folks is getting robbed and shot at the gas station. This nothing new, you feel me? Folks, Ben was getting shot at the gas station, but I don't know what happened after COVID, but like, it done got worse, bro. It's really like the wild, wild west out here. And I'm just upset that like, you know what I'm saying? I Originally, when I got the ratchet, it was for the house. Or just in case something happened when I'm outside, you know what I'm saying? Just in case. But a lot of times I never used to travel with it cuz you know I'm not I'm not on that. You feel me? But right now right now, bro, I'm going to be real with you. Like you need one. You you yo you need one, son. Like you really need one. And I'm upset. This is the reason why we moved out of New York. This is like the main reason why we we got the hell up out of New York, bro. Imagine like you working hard for your stuff and then somebody try to take it from you. Somebody try to hurt you because they don't like the fact that you have it. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I really have to think about what car I get because there's a chance because I, I want to get a, a Challenger. But guess what? You know, you know what kind of cars they breaking in and they, and they stealing the rims and, and they... They taking them to joyride and breaking the windows and doing challenges and charges. Challenges and that, that, that's all they really. I ain't gonna say that's all they looking for, but that's like the the favorite of the thieves. So I have to rethink my decision. Like imagine working hard, but you can't get what you want. Not because you can't afford it, but because you gotta worry about people. Stealing your property or damaging your property. That joint crazy, bro. I seen a video. This chick, she went to the gas station. And um, it was two dudes standing in front of the store. She walked in, she walked out. When she walked out, they both was hiding behind her car. They waited for her to open her car. And one went to the passenger side and put a gun on her face. And the other one yanked out the car. You know what I'm saying? Then I seen another joint. It was a story I read. This dude was at, at um at Waffle House. He at Waffle House, you know what I'm saying, getting his food. He looked outside and it's some folks trying to steal his whip. So, you know, he he wilded out a little bit because you know what I'm saying, you gotta follow the rules, even though you strapped, you still gotta follow the rules. So he shot him. And they ended up being young. Like I think there was like some 13 and a 14 year old so he ended up shooting him and I, he got locked up for that you can't do that though like even though you know I'll be upset if I caught somebody like trying to steal my stuff I'm not just going to open fire on them because it's not that's not really how the rules go you know what I mean like you got to follow the rules like even though I got the strap I understand the rules I'm not going to fire on nobody Based on my pride, you know, I'm not going to fire nobody because I'm upset. No. You feel me? You put me in a life-threatening situation, then I'm going to do that to you. That's that's how it's supposed to be. That's just how it's always supposed to be. Like, I don't show the strap on the channel too much. This is my last time showing my joint on the channel, bro. But I'm... I, I'm just really upset, bro. Like, I'm upset that I really had to do that. Like, I really had to go back in the house to get my strap. Because just in case something happened at the gas station. And I don't know how many of y'all from the South, but look, especially like in Atlanta, bro, when stuff happened, it usually happened either... At the club, in the parking lot at the club, or at the gas station. Like, folks be turning up at the gas station. That's, this is true facts. Feel me? 
I don't even know if true facts go together, but this is facts. This, this is a factual statement that folks be turning up at the gas station. I ain't even going all the way to Quick Trip. I'm finna put that joint right here. Bro, I don't even know how much I want to put in there, bro. Gas done went up. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Biden effing up, dog. Biden effing up. Gas done went, gas done skyrocketed. I remember when $25 used to fill this bad boy. Now I gotta put 40. I ain't putting 40, though. I'm about to put like 30 in this joint. Hold on, man. I'll be back. I was doing all that rambling and talking, and I forgot to mention how they shooting people on the highway. They're literally randomly shooting people on the highway, bro. Imagine you driving in your nice-ass car, and you just happen to look over. You probably glance. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes when you're driving, you might glance at somebody. You just happen to glance at somebody, and they ain't like the way you glance at them. And now, it's bullet holes in your stuff on the highway. That's not cool, man. They try to they try to shoot that rapper on uh, what's his name Shaha the Prince. They try to take him out. I mean I don't know what type of person he is in real life, but from the interviews and stuff, he don't seem like he into none of that BS. So that had to have been random, unless it was mistaken identity. Then it had some rapper that came from um he came from Texas. They let him have it, and the crazy thing, they did that joint right by my job. Like, right over there by, um, Jimmy Carter. You feel me? Like, that's crazy, bro. I don't know what's going on in the A right now, but I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to tell you all this is facts. If it continues, I'm moving. I'm about to go to, like, Wyoming or something like that, bro. One of them, them backcountry yeah, states. Because y'all black folks are wild. This is supposed to be black Hollywood. It's like it's black yeah, excellence out here, bro. This is one of the only places where like it's I'm about to say, a whole bunch of successful the, um, ass black people, and y'all are spoiling it. Yeah. It's okay. messed up. And and the crazy thing is that it's other black folks that's doing that to, to black people. Every time you have black folks trying to make it, you say it's busy. It's other black folks oh, trying to tell shit. you. Shit, my boy getting to that biscuit. It's other black it's folks trying to make us feel uncomfortable. You know, it's good though. For being successful. Shit, bro, I'm out here chilling. It's sad, man. Yo, so it's sad, but look, bit. stay safe out here, dog. Make sure y'all stay safe out here. Folks ain't playing. Squat.